Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. Come, sit down. So Christmas is right around the corner, and you're probably scrambling to find that perfect gift for that special someone. Now, if you want to go with something gaming-related, there are a lot of great choices, but there are some bad ones, too. That's why we here at the Game Station thought we'd put together a Don't Buyer's Guide of Sorts to help you avoid making any bad decisions. So let's get this started. Number five, iPad for the PlayStation 3. Okay, this is no substitute for a real pet. Look at this thing. This looks like something God shot out after a raging bender of Jaeger and weed. If you let this little abomination in your home, I guarantee you your kids will play with it for five minutes and then want to drown it in a river. So don't be an asshat, but I'm a real fucking dog. Number four, any fitness game on any platform. You are fooling yourself if you think this is gonna work. These pieces of shit will get about as much use as that total gym Chuck fucking Norris sold you back in the 90s. Dance Dance Revolution burned more calories than this shit, and it was actually entertaining. I promise you, it won't work, but it will let them know that you think they're fat. Number three, Green Day Rock Band. Why? Because it's fucking Green Day. Number two, GoldenEye for the Wii. Look, I played the shit out of GoldenEye on the N64, like everyone else did. That game was awesome. This game is not that game. The graphics suck, the controls are crap, and the multiplayer is not on par with other shooters on other consoles, okay? Oh, and I've seen some of you guys on the board saying, well, at least it's not fucking Call of Duty. Well, guess what? It uses the Call of Duty engine, so suck a goddamn dick. If I could put the developer in front of me right now, I would punch him so fucking hard that Santa and the elves and the fucking reindeer would cry. And I know everyone's saying this is the best shooter on the Wii, but that's like being an honor roll student in a fucking special ed program. So thank you, Nintendo. Thank you for shooting all over the few good childhood memories that I actually had. And the number one game not to buy is Charm Girls Club Pajama Party for the Wii. Now, let me just read you one of the product features on the back of the box so you can understand. Customize your Charm Girl. Create endless trendy and stylish looks and customize a Charm Girl to reflect your unique style. Choose everything from hair, makeup, wardrobe, shoes, and accessories. This would be funny if it were a joke, but it's not. It's real. Human beings spent an extended period of time making this piece of fucking garbage. 40 years from now, someone will be lying on their deathbed, and they'll look back on their life, and they'll realize that their greatest accomplishment was this fucking game. You can't write something more depressing than that. So that's it for our list of things to not buy for Christmas. And if you have, in fact, bought one of these, then kick yourself in the face, grab the receipt, and take it back and get something else, okay? From all of us here at Game Station, we wish you a Merry Christmas. <laughs> Ecstasy.